Good morning, Positive Astros. Today is Monday, September 16, 2019. My name is Dominic. And my name is Jacob. And welcome, welcome to, to Channel, Channel 5, 5 News. News. That for the day. Today is the first day of a new week. Set goals for yourself and begin with the end in mind. Now over to Caroline with the Pledge of Allegiance and the school's pledge. Will you please stand? I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. I pledge today to do my best. With a great attitude, I will progress. I promise to obey the rules and own my choices each day in school. I'll respect myself and others too and work hard to constantly improve. I am committed to learn all I can. To learn all I can, I am in charge of my life's plan. Now back to the anchor. Thank you, Caroline. Today's announcements, Monday, September 16th, American Founders Month begins. Have a great day. Now over to Mr. Butler for the words of wisdom. Good morning, Positive Astros. Happy Monday. So we have a whole new week ahead of us. That means some new goals and some new responsibilities for some of my friends. And guess what? It also means new mistakes. But what, do, what can we do with mistakes? We fix them. So I don't know if you guys could hear me during the pledge, but I made a mistake. I skipped a line. It was a mistake. So I can fix it, right? So next time I'm going to work better on making sure that I don't miss a line when I'm saying the pledge. I got ahead of myself. That happens. When we make mistakes, we have to be like, okay, it was a mistake. I made it. You own it. And then you work to improve it because we're human. Everybody makes mistakes. Everybody messes up. There's no one that is perfect. No one. Okay? So when you make a mistake, don't get down on yourself. Just say, how am I going to make it better? And then work on making it better. So, now, I want to talk about what our word for the week is. Our word for the week is, hmm, if you're looking at your planner, you should already know what the word for the week is. It's caring. So, we've been talking about this a lot because we talked about compassion, and we've talked about trustworthiness, and people aren't going to trust you if you're not a caring person. Um, so, caring is being kind being helpful, and giving to others, and also valuing the feelings of others. So if somebody says something, and you don't necessarily agree with it, but that's their opinion, you value their opinion. You don't say, oh man, no, it's not like that. You say, oh, okay, that's a different way of thinking about it. I never thought about it like that. Hmm, okay. Sometimes other people think differently than we do, and we need to listen to their opinion and value it as well because their opinion matters just as much as yours does. It's not just your opinion that counts, okay? So on the, the talk of caring, last week I talked about bullying and bystanders. And if you're a caring person, you will not ever stand by to watch somebody be bullied. You will speak up. You will do something about it. So if you see a friend getting picked on or you me getting picked on by somebody, stand up for them. Be a caring individual. Don't allow it to happen. If you know that it's happening or you even feed into it, you're just as bad as the person who's doing it. Now, I know my positive astros do not want to have bad character. They want to have amazing, great character. They don't want to be bullied. 
They don't want to be bystanders. They want to be caring, compassionate, kind, positive astros. And so that's what I ask for you guys to work on is making sure that you are caring, compassionate, kind, positive astros today and every day. So positive astros, make it a great day or not. The choice is yours. Now back to our anchors. Thank you, Mr. Butso. T Tuesday, September 17th, Constitution Day. Fra faculty meeting at 7.45. Wednesday, September 18th, P PPC meeting at 8.15. Thursday, September 19th, fire drill at 10.20. Friday is Spirit Day, so wear your new Armstrong t-shirts and your uniform bottom. Remember to wear your sneakers to keep feet safe. Now over to Miss Morrison. Good morning, Positive Astros, and welcome to Constitution Week. Um, finally, um, at the beginning of each school day, we're, we are going to hear the words from our own Declaration of Independence. I'll start today, and we'll have different readers every day. The Declaration of Independence is an important document for our United States government. And it says, we hold these truths to be self-evident, that all men are created equal, that they are endowed by their creator with certain unalienable rights, that among these are life, liberty, and the pursuit of happiness, that to secure these rights, governments are instituted among men, deriving their powers from the consent of the governed. Thank you for listening to the Declaration of Independence this morning. And now I have in my studio today, I think I see a birthday friend. Come on over. They, see if you can tell if it's her birthday when you see her. <laughs> Come here. Look at this. Good morning. What's your name? Same, Jeff Jennifer. Welcome. And who's your teacher? Miss Murphy and Miss Montgomery. Awesome teachers. And how old are you? Turning. Ten. Turning ten. Oh, she's a double-digit midget. Turning ten. Happy birthday. We're going to do our birthday dance. Are you ready? Do you know it? Okay, just look around because everybody in here is helping you. Get ready. Helpers, here we go. Happy, happy birthday. Get a shell and a dragon tear and a book in the office and enjoy your day. And now, back to the anchors. Thank you, Miss Morrison. Lunch for today. Chicken nuggets, rice pilaf, green beans, Carrot coins, choice of fruit, and milk. Breakfast for tomorrow. Sausage sandwich or choice of cereal with yogurt, oatmeal, and low-fat milk. Now over to Caroline for the weather. Today, partly cloudy, 93 degrees high, 75 degrees low, 20% chance of rain. Tuesday, mostly sunny, 94 degrees high, 72 degrees low, 10% chance of rain. Now back to the anchors. Thank you, Caroline. Birthdays for today. James, Benjamin, Benjamin Chesney, Chesney Sander, Sandra, Sandra, Sandifer, Sandifer, Ma Ma Man, Mason Daly, Seraphin, Shaki, Caden, McRill. Now over to Caroline for the Daily Science Journal. Friday's answer. The word that scientists use when something is partly see partially see through, it is translucent. The science vocabulary words of the day are potential energy. Science sentence for the day. When you hold an object above your head, it has potential energy. Science question of the day. What makes a feather fall more slowly than a rock? Back to the anchors. Thank you, Caroline. Have a great day, Pastor Astros. And thank, thank you for watching Channel, Channel 5 News. We will see you again tomorrow at 825. Have a memorable Monday. Bye.